Welcome back to Let's Play Thomas with Alone. I'm Burning Dog Face. And the apparently sinister Grey seeks desperately to be the first person, maybe the only person, to reach the exit and be free from this uh, system forever. Meanwhile, uh, yes, uh, Sam and Joe here don't realize his sinister intentions and are uh, helping him along the way. But meanwhile, Paul and Team Jump have teamed up to uh, try and stop him. God, they're not even here in order. The team, along with their spiritual leader, Paul, worked their way right. Team Jump were proud of their progress. They'd obliterated all challenges in their path. Yeah, they'd heard of individuals getting stuck on staircases or stepping stones. This did not happen to Team Jump. Just when I thought there were no uh, interesting character... quirks left. Here's a group of uh, AIs that function in unison. Thank you, James. But I can't help but feel a little sad. What did Thomas and Chris contribute? I mean, theoretically, uh, someone like Paul here could receive uh, John's superior jumping ability. But. Chris's only advantage was his shape. You know, that he could go from, uh, he could go into tight spaces. could tell they were nearing the exit portal. He smiled to himself, trying to work out the easiest way of dispensing with his allies when the time came. Dizzy. No, wait, that was right. Come, come. Team 
jump saw the others beyond the wall. They were doing well. Paul tried to shout a warning, but they couldn't hear him. Gray counted five in team jump. Oh, he could take that. Hmm. Okay, where the hell is everyone to start with? Where's the fifth guy? Wait, one. Two. And three, four. Where the fuck is the fifth guy? Wait. Five guys in team job. Joe, Sam, Paul, and Gray. This is more characters than I've ever controlled at once before. Even when I had all of Thomas's gang together. I'm not gonna lie, it's just it's seven, the same number of dudes as in uh, Thomas's full gang. That's not going to get annoying. Thomas and his gang. Why am I doing this? Oh. Well, that makes sense. That'll be really hard for, uh, Paul. Those fuckers will have to move out of the way for the old man! No! There was more to that than just randomly jumping. I tried to see a pattern there. He's taking the gifts of the, uh, the architects... ...and making them... It isn't right! Before, with you know Thomas and Laura being similar shades, but Gray and uh, not Gray, Sam and what? 
What the fu- What the hell? Why isn't that working? Sam and Paul are almost exactly the same shade. Oh no, I have to bring Gray all the way back down. Oh, fun. You're using James's gifts for evil. Could you? I realized the answer to my own question a while back. Even if they didn't intend for only one person to be able to leave the system, it's easy enough to do if you close the door behind you. I think he is the same shade as the uh, members of Team Gray. Team Jump, sorry. Come on, Joe, you can do it. No, 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 no. Get back to her. Yeah. He's right here. He's right here. There. No, 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 no. I will not just mash one button until I reach the right one. Still here. <laughs> what are you doing? But I like that they've still managed to, in this last in these last moments, establish more interesting characters. <clears throat> Paul is the you know the wise old man who knows a lot about the system. Uh, Team Jump are a group of AIs that act as one.
Sam and Joe are, uh... Are, uh, uh, happily, you know... How do I put this? They're a couple already. It's not like Chris and Laura, where they were just sort of flirting around the idea of being with each other. They're a happily established couple. worried at how silent Grey had become. He wasn't responding to Joe's questions or acknowledging them at all. Just a moment. All right. No! No! Okay, once more with feeling. Oh, for... No! I was control... Uh. I can do this. That's not over. I can barely even see Sam here. Ah! Oh, I see. Great. Sorry, is this when the whole rest of the puzzle had been avoid the fields, I I like how you can see in the corner that Sam, uh, Sam and Joe, especially Sam, are tinged with gray because they touched the gray shifter field. Oh. Well, I only bloody made it. AIDS! AIDS! Wonder. Nope. Just do, uh. Objects in the mirror may be stupider than they appear. Nice. I don't understand. Well, let's try exploring with someone who knows this shit better. And by that I mean someone I don't have to go to a huge pain in the ass in order to get fucking past these puzzles. Right. Oop. Oop. Done. <laughs> I'm not even mad about that one. We can do this! Well, you can't. You're a jerk, but... Yes! Victory! Ah! 
What? Fuck! I had the wrong one. <sighs> Piss drink. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Thomas Was Alone. Achieve an unlocked huge success. What? Die 100 times. Of course. I'm pretty sure it's a meta reference to how Gladys from Portal uh, hated you and always thought it was great when you died. How solid and grey had become. He wasn't responding to Joe's questions or acknowledging them at all. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Thomas Was Alone. Let's get past this bit again. And, uh... I'll see you when I resume trying to solve this damn puzzle. Later!